Hello, and thank you for your interest in the Exigent Solutions Clean Tire Bucket. Today we're going to share some of the tips and tricks to help you get up and running as fast as possible with your bucket. The first thing to know is that there are two main components to the Clean Tire Bucket system. First, what we call the Wheel to Drill Adapter, which is available separately if you're interested. This is what allows you to chuck up your go-kart tire and wheel onto a cordless drill. Second is the bucket itself. The bucket has three main features. First, a suggested fill line that will tell you where to put the water for the best results. Second, two scrub brushes that are used to clean dirt off of the surface of the tire. And third, the squeegee. We recommend that bucket owners take a moment to familiarize themselves with the tire washing process before heading to the trap with your bucket for the first time. This will save you the time and hassle of trying to learn the process while you're in a hurry and stressed out at the racetrack. So the first step is to go ahead and chuck up your adapter in your drill. We're going to make sure that the chuck is good and tight. We don't want this guy coming loose on us. We're also going to make sure that the drill is in the lowest speed setting. Next, set the tire sideways on your table. Take the adapter on the drill. Come in the back side of it. Use the centering feature to make sure you're lined up. Make sure that the drill is nice and perpendicular to the back side of the tire. Then we're going to come in the front with the screw cap. Find the end of the threaded rod. Put the drill in tighten or forward, and nice and easy, just cinch the tire down. It doesn't take a whole lot. Then we're going to step over to the bucket, push our tire down to where it's just above the bottom surface of the bucket, and go to town on it. Rock it forward to get that lower side wall, pull it back to get the upper side wall, keep it about vertical to get most of the thread. Once the tire's clean, it's come to a complete stop. We're going to lift up, rotate the tire backwards to drain out any water that might be caught in the back side of the wheel. Come over to our squeegee. Nice and steady pressure, easy and slow on the trigger so you don't throw water on somebody. Keep it tilted up to hit that back side wall. Then we're going to work across the flat of the tire. Then we're going to tilt it up at the very end to get that far side wall. Once our tire's dry, set her back on the table, reverse the drill, pop it loose, and you're ready to go with your next tire. For more information and for frequently asked questions, see us online at exigent-solutions.com.